Hey guys, today we'll be doing a review on these really cool Lola Lucy soft dolls from 2012, series 2. I, um, I am showing Peanut Big Top first though because on my shelf display, I had her in the box. And recently I got the, the past treasure chest doll in the box after that. And Jewel Sparkles and... And Spot Splatter Splash, they're unboxed, but they all have their pets, which is pretty great. I love that a lot. So let's show them off right now. So let's put Peanuts Elephant right here and look at the doll herself. In separate videos, I'll be showing the items. And I also have a different version of Patch Treasure Chest, where it has another tag attached with a few different languages. So let's look at Peanut Big Top first. So this is Peanut Big Top. She is a, like, clown girl with clown clothes. She loves the circus and as you can see she's got her black button eyes right there and she's got her red bows right there which are pretty looking and beautiful as you see there. And it seems like they use the same bows for all the characters though which is pretty awesome and she's got that little star right there on her cheek area. Not on her cheek but holes to her cheek. And then over here, this is what the back of her looks like. The back of her looks pretty awesome. Let me just move my hands out of the way and then probably... Okay, I guess we'll probably look at the tag. And I just want to show this part first. But I have to say this very important lesson though, to keep your toys in great condition. As you can see, it has this heart right here, which says belongs to. They give you an option where you can write your name on here, but I highly recommend you don't do that though, because most most of the time when you use a marker, you are jeopardizing the condition of the item, where usually marker is permanent and you can't get it off of material. So please, if you have one of those, just make sure you don't write that because you want to keep yours in great condition. People like their items in great condition, so how about we just um, look at the tag now, because that's the last thing we need to show the peanut big top. <sighs> Please, I'm trying to show this tag. You might have to do a focus with a light. Okay, let's show the other side of the tag now. This is the other side. Okay, now let's look at her pet elephant. Her pet elephant is pretty cool. It only has two sides. Most of the pets, maybe all of them, were just two-dimensional, the way they made them. So as you can see, this is the elephant. It has ears right here. It's got stitched button eyes, because they want to make these different. And... Here's the other side. It looks the same. Just the only thing is this is the back side of the elephant and it has a heart right there. And it's got this cool looking hat like a ringmaster. And those are types of clowns though. And let's look at Jewel Sparkles next. This is Jewel Sparkles. She's a princess and she has a tiara crown on her head. So let's do it like this. Yeah, it seems like they all have the belongs to thing on their on their um, bottom quarter right there. Except for Pat's treasure chest though, because there's no room on his, so you have to write, or they put on a tag instead. You don't have to write your name on your item, but I still recommend you don't do it though, even if it's on a tag, because you're still making changes to the item. And people like to keep it original. So how about we just look at the tag for Jewel Sparkles now? It's actually attached to her dress instead of her body. Because you know, some dolls are unique to each other. Huh. <sighs> 
And you can actually see something here. It says L and R on her shoes. Forgot to zoom in for that. So let me show you Paint a Big Toss real quick. Because I forgot to show that. If you turn in the light, you'll see it. It's very hard to notice, but it's there. And then we got um, Jules' pet cat right here. The pet cat is pretty cool and funny. Because in the show, this cat can actually have arms. But this one does not have arms because it's sitting down. And it's a plush, so it's different. It's got stitches on the tail to make it look more lined up. There's also a patch on patch heart on her back as well. Uh, okay, next we got spot splatter splash. Let me move jewel sparkles and peanut big top over here so we have more room to show them. So this is Spot Splatter Splash. She's pretty detailed on her outfit here. Because if you see it. Yeah. She's got paint all over her shirt. I mean it's only. It's not real paint. They made it look like paint when they were making this in the factory. Because in the show. And her personality. She likes to paint and make art. Which is great because I like art too. Then she's got the red bows. Like Peanut Big Top. And you know what. Mittens Fluffin' Stuff is from Series 1, and she has the same type of hair and bows as her, just different color bows and hair. And I forgot to mention, all the dolls have a loop on top of their head, so when they're attached to the box. Then you can see L and R on here, it's more noticeable here because of the colors they used. Then there's the belongs to patch right there. Like, like, we got the tag here. Don't worry about it, it's just a notification that I have. Hope you can read that. And now it's looking for pet. Um, her pet is this it's hard to say but it's gotta be some kind of horse or or a zebra I think it's a zebra because it's all stripy but she has paint all over her as well she's got this yarn tail Okay, I'm going to put this down now. And last one we got is Patch Treasure Chest. The Boy and Pirate. So let's hold him up like this. You know, this shirt is kind of acting silly because it's always up. Maybe the way this one was made was different. Try to put a shirt down, but I'm not going to pull too hard because I don't want this to wear and I care about it a lot. He's got the pirate skull right there on his shirt. Then here's the back of what he looks like, but we have to move the tag out of the way. Yeah, so as you can see, he's got this um, patch over his eye right there. It's actually kind of sewn onto him though, so you don't take this off, because they want you to keep this item on him. Then the back of him, he has L and R on his shoes too. Then the tag over here has a heart, just like Pillow Feather Bed from Series 1. You can go to that video, I'll probably have the link in the description. And I'll probably make a playlist for Lala Loopsie items too though, so you guys know what you're seeing. And where to see them. Yeah, it's got, it's got the thing on here instead of on his body, like I said. This is like Pillow Feather Bed, because... They're the only two from the series that have that part where you write your name on the tag instead of the item. Even though I don't recommend you do either. I like to keep them blank. Then there's the tag right there. The regular tag.
Okay, and then last we have the pirate, which that's the pet that he comes with. Seems like all pirates should have parrots with them, so that's why they would put a parrot with this one. He's got a tail right there. I'll just show you the other side of the tail just so you guys know because it's very important to show details if you can. Okay, this is all we have for the toy. So um, please subscribe for more content. You can watch these videos and you can go to the playlist to see more. Please subscribe for more content.